December, I was traveling all the way from Lagos to uh, Omaha for a barrier. We are using private car. So reaching to Onicha, second bridge, the driver that was carrying me was doing something on his phone. So I did not know that it's Google map that he's using to enter Omaha. So we enter Oba from there, you know, bus at Okibwe, where all these things are happening. Where all these things are happening. People has, the, people's hearts are covered with bush. So when we, when we entered that road, I was so scared. But one spirit told me that only who have been leading you through this journey. So I shake off the fear. Because if you drop pin, you will hear the sound of the pin. We did not see anybody, nobody passed us when we entered that road. So after a minute, we see these people. They, about eight of them, they line up. They wave us like this to stop. So when I saw them, I told the driver, it's only me and the driver and the load. So I told the driver, please stop for them. If not kidnap her, no problem. If not kill him, no problem. Anything, no problem, but stop for them. I don't know that there's, the driver that is with me is a very stubborn driver. So immediately, we neared them. The driver wanted to park and zoom off. Immediately, he zoomed off. These people started shooting. They started shooting. If you see shooting, how? I was looking at heaven. Then I raised this my wristband. I saw Omi oh, Huku Jesus. This is my testimony. Whether death or alive. This is my testimony. Immediately I said that that was. I don't know what happened. It's like our car. Something shield. Please cover look us. at the screen. Something screen cover our car. So we are we are running to. We don't know that there's another set of people, another set of them that is front. So those people see us and started shooting us. The first people that have started shooting us has used bike, about four bikes, and started pushing us at back. The front one was shooting. The back one was shooting. I don't know what to do. But I said, Jesus, only who could Jesus, that this is my testimony. That this is my testimony. That's what I was saying that day. So when we are running, we don't know. When we pass the second people, we don't know that another third of, another third person again. How? When I saw those words, I know that it is finished. There is no way for us again. I know that this is death. You understand? So yes. when I, when the when the oh, when, when our hey, car stop, we had the block road. road. The top people there. leave us say, "Oh yeah, they go now." So, we 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 so when we when our car stop, we had the block road with all these big trees. They rush. Driver, the drop, they bring a driver from the car. Testimony. They start a big driver. I was inside the car. I was arranging my bag. When I come out, I just raised my hand like this. So my phone rang. I wanted to pick it. One of them snatched it from me. Say, you don't know where you are. And you're answering call. You don't know where you are. You're answering call. They wanted to beat me. The second on command of don't. them say, don't touch her. She's a woman. We don't beat woman. So they started beating driver, break driver head. Make sure that the, every part of driver's body was wounded. So they carry us to where they are point, where they know, keep we moving, something has like that. We, this thing was happening around 6.30 to 7. We stayed there until 10 o'clock in the evening. When the ogre of them all came, they say, they, he said, what did they do to, for the driver? They said they did not do anything for the driver. We said they have beat the driver blue, black, every color in this world. They beat for the driver. So they said they did not do anything for the driver. They say they are going to say, where's this man? Put it inside their car and burn them. Hey, I was shocked. I said, oh me, who could Jesus? Oh me, who could Jesus? You mean who could Jesus? This is your time to prove me that, yes, I'm serving a living God here. I was there. I was begging the ogre. It's when the, 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 the ogre noticed me. He said, you. Then he come closer towards me, looking at me, eyebob to eyebob, like two minutes. He said, which church do you go? I saw her. Look at him. Oh, me, who put Jesus? Do I not grant him? So when I said it, when I said it, he said, upon everything, his voice shoot us. There is no gun that the place that, that no gun touch us. Upon all to all, everything that his voice shoot us, that no gun, no bullets touch us. I say it's not. That's their Jesus. leader telling saying this. this uh, the I leader say, is already testifying, you know. I say I say I should go and thank God. 
that this place nobody comes alive that nobody comes alive do i know how many people that have died here both army police and the other people i said oh me put jesus with me i was saying i was saying that one in my mind so when i was there with them around around 12 1 2 around 12 1 so i was cold that's where they're now. That's the Hamatan side. I was feeling, I was feeling foolish. So he asked me to go and inside their kiosk there to go and sit down. When I was sitting down, my tummy started paining me. He asked me, what is wrong with you? I said, this morning, I never eat because we left around 3 o'clock in the morning. Say, I never eat, I never drink water because the driver is rushing to drop me and go to Calabatica and carry me another motor to come back to Lagos. So he said, okay. I said, please give me water, let me drink. He said, you don't know where you are, you're asking for water. I said, please give me water, my throat is drying. So he signaled one of them one of his boys so I bring water he give me water I drink the first cup he look at me and ask me are you okay I said no sir I'm not okay I need another cup let me drink he give me another one I drink so immediately I drink that drink that water my tummy turn so I was bending like this he bend and look at me are you okay are you all right I say I'm hungry he said I should bring us money I bring us 500 naira he give one of his boys to go nearby village to go and buy bread and min uh, mineral for me so, <laughs> so that one went to go and buy bread and mineral. So I, I was there. I was asking. I was. I, we had, we had, me and me and him was talking like brothers and sisters. Then, before that one came. He bring my phone, because this is to our phone. He give me back to my phone. I should check whether there is anything missing. He give me my phone, give the driver's phone and the driver's wallet. Then I, I, my phone was done. I was telling him that my brother would be worried now because the, my phone is done. He signaled one of them to bring power back for me. I powered my phone. So... But I Oh, 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 oh,